Thomas first went to Farquhar Station to tell Toby. Toby, said Thomas, you know that a tornado might be coming? Really, said Toby? What? Yes, said Thomas, a tornado might be coming. What's this about a tornado, said Bertie, as he rolled in? Yes, Bertie, said Thomas, a tornado might be coming to the island. Okay, said Bertie, uh, uh. So Tom has on board. Yes, see. Well, get him, said Toby. We, we. Sir Topham Hat, said Bertie. Uh, Sir, Sir Topham Hat, said Bertie. The island of Sodor is under cease by a tornado. Oh, really, said Sir Topham Hat? Oh, geez, said Thomas. Like you didn't know that, Sir Topham Hat. Uh, seriously, Thomas, I really did not know that the island of Sodor possibly would be struck by a severe storm today. I really didn't. I was just at home enjoying my tea and crumpets. But. Come on, Bertie, let's go. Where are we going, said Bertie. We're going to go to the docks. Come on. And Bertie and Puff rode away. Anyways, said Toby, I'm going to go too. Yes, come on then, said Thomas. Then Samson arrived at the yards. Stephanie Duck Percy, said Samson. What, 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 the three engines said. A tornado might be coming to the island. What, said Percy. Yes, said Samson, a tornado might be coming to the island of Sodor. That's unheard of, said Stephanie. Oh, it's not, said Percy. We get those, we get maybe a small spin-up tornado or three or two every year. Yes, said Duck. But, but by the way, Samson, Sandy, it sounds like that today's going to be a really, really bad, possibly tragic day. Yes, said Samson, that's how I heard it from... High road, something like that, some engine like that. Come on, let's go. Where are we going? Let's go, let's go. Warn engines. Oh, oh, come on, this at the end. And James is fucking wrong. Come on, coaches. Come on, come on, come along, said James. When you came into Ellsbridge and warned all the passengers, Quit! A tornado might be coming! What? said all the passengers. All the passengers, even guards that were in the station, got on board the passengers, got on board the coaches. And all the coaches, I mean, and both the coaches were full. Some passengers even had to come into James's firebox where the where his driver and fireman was, and some passengers even had to sit on the floor and stand on the rails. Alright then, let's go, said James, and he rode away. Soon James and Toby met up with each other. Toby, 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 said James. What, said Toby? Do you see this? What, said Toby? Do you see this? What, said Toby impatiently. All my passengers are full. All my coaches are full. Wow, said Toby, you gotta put them somewhere. I know, said James. I'm about to go to the dock. So Tom has on board me. Sure, said James. We're going to meet you all these passengers. Bring them to the dock first. Said the top hat. And then I want you to bring them to the smelters. Because that's a steel area. Okay then, sir. Said James. I'll do that. Come on. James went to the dock. And Toby and Thomas followed. While Flynn was talking to Salty about it, a tornado might be coming. A tornado, me hearty, said Salty. Arr. I never heard of, I never heard of one that serious ever, said Salty. It must be serious. Then. It must be. That's how I heard it from Hero, said Flynn. What? Said Cranky. A tornado might be coming. Uh, uh oh, said Cranky. What? 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 Said Flynn. I think I see a developing, what do you call them, wall clouds? Where? Near in the distance, I think I see a developing wall cloud. Oh no, said Flynn. We have too many engines. Oh no, said Salty. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Oh dear, said Salty. What, said Flynn? You about to nervous? Yes, yeah, said Salty. I'm very nervous. I'm very nervous, me hardy. Snap out of it, Salty, said Salty himself. Uh, I've been through I've been through hurricanes before and I am not scared of a tornado. James arrived. 
Flynn, you know a tornado is coming, right? I heard already, said Flynn. But James, you gotta get those passengers somewhere, somewhere steel area. I know, said Cranky. Maybe the smelters. Yeah, that's what Sir Topham Hat said, said James. Come on and let's go. And James rolled away with his passengers.